state senator wants to give all Nebraskans $200. Yeah, senator John Kavanaugh says he wants to issue the refunds in place of a plan to lower the top individual and corporate income tax rates. As KETV News Watch 7's Alex McLoon reports, advocates say the payments could make a big difference to people in need. $200 would go such a long way for them. Support Services Supervisor Rosalind Maldonado says 200 bucks brings a bit of stability, whether it pays for utilities or groceries. We get about 10 to 20 referrals coming in every day, honestly. Community Action Nebraska says most of their clientele is made up of working families and retirees on fixed income. Their bills are piling up and that's why this group is advocating for those one-time payments. State Senator John Kavanaugh filibustered LB 939 Tuesday, a bill that cuts personal and corporate income taxes. Pushing out the implementation of a massive tax cut for mostly for rich people and corporations is irresponsible in that sense that we don't know what the fiscal picture is going to look like when that, that bill comes due. Senator Lou Ann Linehan said the state couldn't afford Kavanaugh's amendment. She then asked to pull the bill itself after hours of debate. His other part of his bill where he wants to give everybody $200, every man, woman, and child, whether or not they pay income taxes. That, that might be a good idea, but it's not an income tax cut. Speaker Mike Hilger says Linehan intends to put a compromise amendment into another priority bill. So LB 939 will not come back um, at Senator Linehan's request. But with Nebraskans facing setbacks like lack of daycare, Maldonado hopes senators will help families get back on their feet. There's always that kind of bright side at the end of the tunnel that we're hoping to bring our families to. Alex McClune, KETV News Watch 7.